Welcome to PowerTech Insights. In this tutorial, I'll guide you to perform a CT ratio test using the Omicron CPC 100. Let's get started. Purpose of the test. A CT ratio test verifies that the current transformer provides the correct transformation ratio between the primary and secondary windings. The Omicron CPC 100 can be used to perform this test efficiently. Safety precautions. To ensure safety, always verify proper grounding before testing. Avoid touching any live parts. Use PPE to protect yourself, including HV insulated gloves and face shields. Ensure that all safety protocols are in place, such as lockout, tagout, and PTW procedures. Ensure the CT is disconnected from the system. Properly ground the CPC-100 and CT before starting. If testing on a live system, use non-intrusive methods like a clamp meter, required equipment, and tools. Omicron CPC-100 for injecting control current and voltage signals for testing relays protection. Clamp or amperes meter. Appropriate cables for secure connection to the CPC-100 and to the CT terminals. Earthing stick to discharge the test line. Controlled environment for safety. Verify that all test instruments are calibrated and fully functional. Connection setup for CT ratio test. Primary side wiring for current injection. Use a bar with sufficient cross-sectional area to handle the required test current. Identify the CT primary terminals P1 and P2. The length should be enough to easily pass through the CT core window. Pass the copper bar through the CT window. Connect the CPC 100 current output terminals to each end of the copper bar. Connect one end of copper bar to CPC 100 AC current positive output. Connect other end of copper bar to CPC 100 AC current return negative output or ground. Ensure the copper bar is firmly clamped at both ends for a good electrical connection. Secondary side wiring for measurement. Identify the CT secondary terminals S1 and S2. Connect CPC 100 terminals across the secondary. Connect CT S1 to CPC 100 current measurement input plus I. Connect CT S2 to CPC 100 current measurement input I or ground. Performing the CT ratio test. Power on the CPC 100 and navigate to the CT ratio test mode. Choose the injection method. Select current injection. Enter the CT nameplate ratio, for example, 1251.
Running the test. Start the test by injecting a test current, for example, 50A on the primary. The CPC100 measures the secondary current output automatically. The CPC100 displays the measured ratio and deviation. Compare the measured value with the expected CT ratio. Conclusion. Using a copper bar as the CT primary is an effective method for CT ratio testing with CPC100. It is widely used for large window type CTs and high current tests. Ensure proper connections, grounding, and test current settings for accurate results. Warning. Always ensure that testing should be conducted by qualified personnel familiar with protection systems and that all safety procedures are strictly followed. Attempting these without proper training and safety precautions can result in serious injury or death. Do not try this at home or without the necessary expertise. PowerTech Insights is not responsible for any harm or damage caused by improper handling of electrical systems. Stay safe. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more expert tutorials. See you in the next video.